somebody dear Give us cause to shed a tear and mourn For they are gone Now all that's left is a faint memory Based on the theme of a strange melody Still we must think of them and recall their image with pride Telling people from deep inside This is dedicated to those who died How many have known a friend Playing mass down to the end Who will never again And though we play now and then thoughts will stray To that dear one who has since passed away So for this carnival while you're jumping up take a break Try and take in this song I made To remember for all time's sake by the sea imagines what the those first people coming in on the boats might have encountered about San Fernando and this is a good place right here because mainly this is where the story of San Fernando really begins because it was a city like most of it founded by sea a mural by the sea happens in a very simple way in the early Yes, I remember sign painters were very critical to the commerce of things. And in places like these bars, you would have found a lot of murals. Very naive artists, simple artists, come up with enamel paints, different colors. I was one of them did that. And they would paint all the sceneries. So the bars were decorative bars. You know, it, it wasn't just a digital or a carib sign a big elaborate scene of fishermen and you know that kind of thing so that that image brings the mural to mind but that image also had people and therefore the image has stories and, and that begins the journey Mural by the sea. The cocks are crowing from end to end. 
The last train of the old Calypso ruts in the round by the convent. Man passing. The woman with fogged glasses is fanning. The woman with a crooked wig is fanning. The woman in grey kicked off her shoes. The woman in white kicked off her shoes. The woman in brown kicked off her shoes. Leo the Jab Jab is standing predominate among the shoes. The woman in grey has found her mirror in an Indian's eyes. They meet and collide. We collect the scattered cigarettes and coins that roll away. We meet at the steel margin of the soul between hill and sea at the edge of memory on an old map of the world. Not a day passes when the moon is not crushed into a million, when each shard does not sharply recall the dutiful ocean, mud road, or whistling eye of a star, novellas brought on the wings of the trade winds, the huge and sorrowful parting of the bocas. We wake with the indifferent light of morning against the treacherous shadows of day. A horsewhip slithers through the grasslands of Vista Bella, through Marabella, making its way past the silver domes of Pointe Pierre. Lush acres of cane fields stretching across central, yellow carob smoking leaves under the Arima dial, a herd's boy and his mud caked bulls at Aranguez, the blackened corridors of old South Key Station. Savannas and swamps team with history set in coastal sunsets. Grinning monkeys by the luminous river where all along we lived in the sign painter's eyes. His sweeping skies and emphysemic horizons going down, down at dusk. A flaming cane arrow pierces an ox pecker cloud, curls to ash like swamp grass to a sadhu's prayer. The last train to San Fernando is the last train to San Fernando. And if you miss this one, we'll never ever get another one. It's the last train to San Fernando. And here we are, Sarah, resurrected in the forest of mass and myth, the enamel world of the flame, braving silence for a singular language, occasional light, occasional stone. <laughs> Bam, 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 bam,
Bam, bam, bam, bam, bam, bam, bam, bam, bam, bam, bam, bam, bam, bam, bam, bam, bam, bam, bam, bam, bam, bam, bam, bam, bam, bam, bam, bam, bam, bam, bam, bam, bam,